We talked about our beam width method in our computations menu. The difference between these beam width methods is d4 sigma, 90, 10 knife edge, 1 over e squared. They're all very similar. But which one's the right one to use? It's based off of your application. They're all very similar. But beam gauge has the ability to display all of those beam width methods. We can use one as our core and then back calculate what the other ones are equal to. So right now I'm using 9010 knife edge as my core, but I can still turn on and see what my D4 sigma widths are, are based off of. So it's showing me my D4 sigma beam diameter and my 9010 knife edge diameter. Notice they are different because we're cutting the data differently and that's okay. Depends on how I want to see the data and how I want to measure it. So the D4 sigma method starts and works its way out. So it starts at the center of the beam and goes out four standard deviations and says draw my beam diameter at four standard deviations out. That's what D4 sigma means. 9010 knife edge means I'm starting at my edge and I'm bringing my knife edge in until I transmit 90% and I put my marker there. Then I move across until I am blocking 90%, only transmitting 10%. And that's where I put my second marker. And the separation between those two markers, that's my width information. Now based on my mode content, if I've got a Gaussian distribution, there's a specific multiplier that's used there. But that's the difference between 90, 10, knife edge, and 4 sigma. 4 sigma looks at the noise and the energy distribution versus 90, 10, knife edge simulates a knife edge actually sliding through the beam path. And that's one that's been around for a very long time. Before cameras were used for laser beam profiling, we used a power meter and that knife edge, and that's how we would measure it. Cameras make things a lot more easy. And that's why the four sigma is what we use, because it works better for a camera, because it looks at the whole distribution and not just one slice of data.